So there's a metric more important than ROAS than you should be tracking with your ad campaigns. Most people are tracking ROAS because maybe they're using a tool or they're just posting screenshots online. You've probably seen all of those. But what I would say is ROAS isn't that helpful because oftentimes what ROAS misses are the expenses built into a business, the fixed expenses for delivering a product that you're not taking into account for because all you're looking at is top line sales and ad spend. So here's what you look at instead. Look at the contribution margin for your advertising. So what you want to do is take your advertising spend, then you want to figure out what is your cost to acquire a customer, and then you want to figure out what are your fixed expenses to get that customer as well. So you're looking at your ad spend, and you're also looking at agency fees, what does it take for you to deliver that product, if you've got some like hard costs involved, maybe you ship out something in the mail or something to people. You want to take into consideration any expenses that go along with your marketing funnel, so maybe that's software, anything like that. Because what you can do is you can take those expenses into consideration, and then you can figure out what is your real cost to acquire a customer that's not just your ad spend, but your ad spend plus fixed expenses. And that will give you a much clearer picture on what is costing you to acquire new customers, and it'll give you a better direction to move forward when you're thinking about how to move forward with your campaigns.